Hello there guys, and welcome back to Day Z. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been on Day Z. But I, uh, the server that I was playing on was closed, and I've been looking for a different server with certain rules and aspects and things, and I have found one. So this is the Aftermath server. It's a private server. Uh, well, no, it's not a private server. You can find it on the launcher, but it's, um... Privately run, the mods are mostly private, <laughs> so, and it's got active admins, there's a server restart every four hours, I think it is, or three hours, can't remember now. But yeah, quite a few people are playing on this server, it's very full all of the time, uh, so I can only manage to get in in certain times. But there is still 50 people on this server currently, and the best thing is that it has a map, so we can see where we are, and I'm here. And obviously I've just literally spawned in, I looted this town here, and I actually managed to get myself quite a few things. Uh, I got myself a carbine, I got myself a Mark II silenced pistol, and I also got myself a... the Enfield, with a sight. Uh, and I found some ammo for everything, so we're actually not too bad. Also, the good thing about this server is it has quests, and this is the first quest you get, as you can see, if I go back to the map. There's survivor quest, there's zombie hunting quest, there is the trader, there's contract killer, exploration, the black market trader. So in the altar trader where it's green, there is a, um, a non-PV E zone, so you can't be killed in there. Uh, but in the black market traders, which are red, oh, well, there's a hunting quest over there as well. Uh, in the black market traders, there is PvP, so those ones are a bit more. You may get more things up here for cheaper prices, but you have the danger of being killed. Whereas in the ultra trader, you're pretty okay. So, my first quest is this survivor quest, and well, I've basically done everything. I've drunk from a well. I haven't bandaged myself. I need to kill a cock. Male chicken, that is. Uh, cut down a bush, I've done. Break a stick, I've done. Light a fire, I've done. And then I need to go and visit him. And these are the rewards you can get. You can get a Mosin. So it's going to be one... I don't think it's all of this, but it is, you know, these are what you can get out of the rewards. So it's pretty cool. But I do actually have a... A sort of goal of my own for this playthrough and that is this server has got vehicles on it and there's one particular vehicle that I want to buy um, if we can get to the trader today I'll show you <coughs> or I might put a screenshot on it actually it's yeah I'll put, I'll put a screenshot up now it's basically a mobile tank with living quarters I mean it's awesome Care package. Oh yeah, also this server has got airdrops, care packages, it's got capture zones. It's a really, really good server. I've been watching it for quite a while. Um, but yeah, this is the vehicle that I want, basically. And the only problem is, it costs $30,000 units, pounds, whatever. Which is a lot. So we need to loot, sell, get money, buy. So that's it. But right now, at the start of this episode... What I might do <clears throat> is I really need to see if I can find this cock. Again, that's the male chicken that I need to find. And normally, if you just sort of scout around... Oh, there you go. Look, see? Hotel Survivor Camp is 50% captured. There are different actions that you can do that are randomly set across the map where, you know, you can... Capture, for example, this camp and... Ooh, hello. Actually, no, I need to let him hit me because then I can bandage myself. Go on then, hit me. There you go. Thank you. Right. Let's just check if he's got anything. Oh, alright, let's get into the police station here. And, um, bandage ourselves. And then that will be the next thing ticked off of my list. And then what I've got to do is just find this cock. Right. 
Ooh, a plate vest. Hello. Oh, damn. I'm going to take that. All right, bandage. Bandage myself. There we go. And then if we go back to the book, it should say bandage yourself one of one. Good. So all I've literally got left now is stab vest. Plate vest is better. Is literally, I just need to find a cock. If we can, police jacket, no. Okay, so at least I know that the doors are closed, so nobody's been here. Which is always good. What is that? Okay, we'll take it. Can be sold. An MP5 magazine, what I call an MP5 magazine. What is this? Oh, another magazine. Actually, I think. Did that go? And a 61. Yeah, 61 mag. I needed 15 for the pistol. I did actually manage to find quite a lot of things uh, on my first run. And obviously there are the mods here which have... Oh, hello. What have we got here? A worn UMP. Oh, almost, almost like my scum loadout. CR-75 is pristine and that one, I think, is worn. Yes, so what we'll do is we'll take that one and we'll take that one. That one's pristine. We can put the torch on there and we can put the sight on there. There we go. What is that magazine? I'll take it because it can all be sold, basically. I mean, regarding the... Ooh, binos. They're very handy. Regarding the PvP aspect, obviously I will engage. And I do know that on this particular server there are friendlies and there are hostiles. So there are guys who are just going to shoot. You know, on site, they're not going to ask any questions. They're just going to see you, shoot you, and steal all of your stuff. But then there are other people. 45 ACP, that's for the machine gun. I don't think... Yeah, that's for... That. I don't think I have... No, I don't have any 45 ACP at all. Okay. Right. Um... Oh, I also forgot to tell you that I have a Winchester. Uh -huh. Lol. Uh, let me just put these... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Bugger. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I need to take that off. Where is it gone? Because... It has got my machete on it. There it is. Six. Right, okay. Yeah, I also have a Winnie as well. Which is quite nice. So we're actually pretty pretty looted and booted, if I'm honest. Isn't too bad. Right, let's get out of here if I can remember the way out. This way. So all I need to do now is find Mr. Chicken. And see if we can kill him. Do I need to cook him again? Uh, I think I do. Is that a gun weapon repair kit? Oh, yes, that's good. That is a better R39. That is a... That actually has a magazine in it. Uh, hang on, I need to do a bit of jiggery-pokery. See if I can fit this all in. The problem is I still don't know what is good and what is not good, so... I've got quite a bit of learning to do in terms of the weapons. Obviously, the higher caliber is going to be better for annihilating. Right. Got rid of him. 
let's just grab a quick drink whilst we're here. My bottle is full, and I do have another one as well, actually. Let's just get this up. Right, there we go. Where is my water bottle? There we go. Fill that up. No, oh, I want to fill it. That one. Wrong button. My bad. Yes, I can see that zombie over there. <clears throat> I can actually call them zombies this time because they are zombies. They're not puppets. But I need to find the chicken. And then go to the trader. Or the, the other dude. Alright, let's get away from you. For you. Disinfectant is always good. I also need to work on my clothing because having a bright blue... A bright blue police jacket is not the best thing for camouflage. Or red. Back suits I don't want. Yeah, I do I, I do enjoy playing Daisy, I have to say. I do miss playing Daisy. Considering it's you know No idea, but I'll take it. No, I don't want a hard hat. It is quite old now, Daisy. But it's still an awesome game. Now normally there are chickens around here. I just need to listen out for that all-famous... Uh, yes, killer cock. That's all i got to do. I just need to find this damn chicken. And they're normally around here. Just need to listen out for it. That is an open door. Can't hear anything. If I'm honest. Hmm. Come on, Mr. Chicken. Where are you? So I need to keep my head on a swivel because, like I said, there are 50 other people here. Oh, no chicken sounds. But yes, someone has been here because the doors are open. Someone has definitely been here. More open doors there. Hmm. Okay. Don't see any chickens. But we do have some ammo. Again, it can all be sold. Uh, I don't particularly want to dress. Thank you. Right, let me just have a quick flick through my inventory. What have we got? Quite a bit, actually. Uh, how are we food? Yeah, we could eat something. Yeah, okay, let's eat this. Alright, and then that will also make me thirsty because it is... Um, dry, salty crisps. Care package has landed at the airstrip. See, and all of this stuff contains... Obviously contains better loot, you know, more weapons and all that kind of stuff. Can I... Is any of this... This is worn. I can't remember the, the state. I think it's badly damaged. Is the state in which you can repair weapons at. If I remember... Right, back to chicken hunting. You just need to sort of walk around and eventually you'll hear the, the chicken. But the problem is, is that 
We need to know if it's a male or a female. Because obviously we need a cockerel. Uh, nope. What is that? More salty crisps. We'll take them. Ooh, hello, Bob. Okay, I honestly thought I missed that shot then for a second. I really did. Oh, you had a magazine. You also had a police vest as well, but I'll stick with my factory vests. Alright, well that mark up there you can see is the trader. So I think I'm just going to head on this road. I know that you shouldn't actually stand on the roads. <laughs> Probably the worst place to be. But I think I'm just going to stand... Not stand. I'm going to run up that path. And hopefully we'll find a chicken on the way. <clears throat> An Ikea truck. Interesting. Oh, Gorka Police Station. That's actually quite close. Yeah, see? There it is. Okay, a bit further away than I thought. It's closer to the trader. Anything in here? Denim skirt? No, I'm not about... Not about wearing skirts at the moment. The good thing is... What is that? What is that? What is that? DMR mag. Ooh, that's the new mag for the new gun, which came out just in their, um, in the 1.93 update. Ooh. That kind of makes me a bit of a wanted target because everybody will currently be looking for the new DMR, and I now have a 20 round mag for it. So... <laughs> Yeah, that's a bit uh, leather sewing kit. I have no space for it. I'm going to have to get rid of something here. Uh, let's get rid of the bark. And I want to sell all of this stuff. That's the whole point. I don't particularly want to throw it away. I would like to sell it. Oh well, we'll see. We'll see. Probably not going to get to the trader today because it is a bit of a hike through the forest. There's an adventure backpack which has got more slots than mine. So we shall take that. Most certainly we shall take that. Now I can put a few more things spread out a bit evenlier. And let's put the gun... There we go, that's full. Is that a vehicle or was that a door? Oh, wait, my machete. Shit. I forgot about that. Can I put that on... Ah, I can't put that on my adventure pack back. Okay, but I can put it there, though. That's fine. Again, it's red. <laughs> Not the most camouflage thing in the world. And still no sounds of any chickens. Whoa. Hello. Okay, dude, I'm friendly. I'm not going to shoot you. Oh, hello, hello. You okay? Hold on, shut my pants right there. Yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> you just spawned in, yeah? Yeah, I just spawned in right uh, over there. Okay, the, I haven't looted the town. There's still a load of stuff in the town if you want to go and loot the town. So, it's pretty... There's still a load of stuff there. Okay, okay, okay. Thanks. You can, you can cool. have this house then. <laughs> That's alright. No, no, it's alright. No worries. I'm not going to kill you. Don't worry. Okay, okay. Thanks, thanks. Hey, I told you I'd be friendly. But also, I didn't hear him. Which is bad on my behalf. Because I should have heard him. Which is not good. But we'll leave him be. I'm clearly a lot more geared than he is, so, you know. That would have been a little bit unfair if I uh, killed him. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not a savage, unless I have to be. <clears throat> like I said, I will engage if I need to. But if I can hear 
you know, that there's a gunfight going on and they have higher caliber weapons than me, then, you know, I'm not going to go and get involved. I'm just going to let it be. Because I'm not all about that. Right, what I am about now, though, is this bloody chicken. Which I still can't hear. Can't hear any chicken noises. Which is really annoying. Let's just have a quick look at the map. And see where we are. We are here. Uh, there's a military place over there. I mean, I could just head up and hope we find a chicken on the way. Just need to listen out for it, really. That's all I can do. But yeah, I really do like Daisy. Daisy and Scum. So I'm glad to be back on it again. I have to say. But I just need to keep my head on a swivel. Because there can be proners in bushes who I will not see. Wearing ghillie suits. Who were way more kitted than me. What is that? Oh! One tip, if you find anything containing liquid, always empty it first and refill it from a well. Because somebody could have simply poisoned that and I could drink it, get, die, uh, get sick and then die. So any liquids you see... Always, always empty them first and then refill them. Just so you know that you're safe. Right. I really need to find... Yeah, I did actually kill a chicken, but it was a female. It wasn't a male. So my quest has not been completed. Uh... Classic flavoured wafer. Okay, might as well eat that as well. Again, I still can't hear any chickens. Or cockles, rather. Which is what I'm really after. That bird is so loud. It really is. Ah. Uh, I thought that was deer then, but it wasn't. Let's just have a quick look. Yeah, we could have gone into this town as well. But, I mean, chickens and things and cockles and animals, they do spawn randomly. So, you know. Oh, but what I do know is if you see some spooked deer... For example, and you're absolutely certain it wasn't you that spooked them, then it means that there is a player in the area. So it's something to, again, be mindful of. Let's just have a look what we've got in here. We have a rather large axe, which I cannot put anywhere. But I'm not quite in need of axes yet. I will obviously need it for putting up bases and walls and stuff like that. Come on, Mr. Chicken, where are you? Mr. Cockerel, rather. Where are you? It's a hay stand here. local farmers feeding the wildlife which is always good to see right we're almost almost at the um, the first completed quest 
but I still haven't got a chicken. Okay, you can see in the chat there that there are other people here. But also, there might be people camping this, so need to be a little bit on guard. The reason why I don't always hold my weapon is because normally the rule of thumb is if you've got your weapon out, you're a potential danger. If you've got your weapon away, then it may entice other players not to kill you straight off the bat, but to rather sort of, you know, maybe let you go by or, or simply start talking to you first before they shoot you. So, that's why I don't have my weapon out all of the time. <clears throat> but I have it out now, because like I said, there could be people camping here. So it could be someone up there full now. Still no chicken. And I can't hear any chicken noises. very annoying. Alright, the trader dude is in here. But I've just seen a flashlight with a battery. That's going to come in handy for night time. Mr. Trader is in here. Not, tra not trader, sorry, but Mr. Quest. Yeah, all of this wooden stuff in here is new now. This came with the new update. Where is he? There he is. Yes, but I haven't completed it because I need a bloody cock. It's very annoying. Anything up here? Other than being sniped? I just need to hear it. Once I hear it, I can track it. Right, so, where are we? We're here. I think it's best if we head to this town over here, if I'm honest. 1.2 clicks away. I don't know why I said 1.2 clicks. I hate that expression. I do apologize. Right, let's head over to that town and see if we can find... A cook! Roll. A cook roll. What we need. I have to say, I'm glad I found that torch, though. That was nice. That was a nice little find. Now, maybe we should head up to the road. Because, I don't know, my, my gut feeling is they're going to more closer to the roadside and the towns don't ask me why it's just my gut feeling I could be completely wrong with that but <clears throat> I cer certainly have found them <clears throat> in towns before and in open areas like that over there was that a chicken? Hold it. Did I just hear a gobble gobble of a chicken? Oh. I think my mind <clears throat> is playing tricks on me. Because I really want a chicken. So I think my mind is playing tricks on me. Yeah, let's stick to the path. Although, alongside the path. Because I'll just be an easy sniper target. Yeah, see, I was saying, in these open places I have found chickens before. Not so much in thick, dense forests. So hopefully... 
All we need is the lovely sound of the gobble gobble. I shouldn't be running through an open field like this. But, you know. I'm giving everybody the benefit of the doubt, which is probably something I shouldn't do. Because I'm hoping I'm not going to be killed straight away. So, um... I'm, ho I'm hoping to have other interactions rather than just point, click, and die. Is there a chicken? No chickens. Uh, I don't <clears throat> think there's any bear mods on this map. There's definitely wolves, I know that. But theres I don't think they have implemented the bear mod. So it but I'm, again, I'm not sure about that. I could be wrong. But I hope I don't run into any bears. Because, um... Yeah, that thing would just eat me alive. Can we get in here? No? Yes. Oh, a floating... A floating... A floating teapot hat, which I don't want. Where the hell is this chicken? Anything in here? Another backpack. Hunter backpack 63 and I've got 49. Now I'll stick with mine. Thank you. <clears throat> Obviously, I'm... Like I said, my goal really is to get this... Get this vehicle. So I'm not necessarily going for the best loot, the best guns, all that kind of stuff. Not yet, anyway. Not yet, anyway. Plus, I'm still too much of a freshie to be doing stuff like that in Daisy. You know. There are people who have got thousands upon thousands of hours on Daisy who know this place literally like the back of their hand. And then you've got freshies like me who just come in and go, Oh, where do we go? Oh, look, a building. And then you just, boom, you're dead. So, yeah. <clears throat> Still no sound of a chicken. Which is rather annoying. Bloody little shrubbery bushes, they look like little animals. All I need is the gobbledygook. If they give me the gobbledygook, it will be good, because then, like I said, I can just crack it and follow it. It's still no gobbledygook. Which is very, very annoying. All I need to hear. Is the gobbledygook. Oh. What was that noise? That sounded like something. Right, there is a town. There is a town. And what I do have, which I took, is my binos. It's a tree stump. Right, I can't see any zombies. So it doesn't look like there's anybody here. There's no doors open over there. But that's not to say there isn't anybody here. Always keep your eyes on a swivel. Heat pack, I'll take that. That's always good in case I get chilly. Yeah, I can't see any puppets. Doors are closed. 
most annoying thing is I still can't see any chickens either. But then again, I don't think I would see a chicken from that distance. As long as there's no zombies here. I just said puppets, didn't I? Yeah. <laughs> as long as there's no zombies here. Or Zeds. However you want to call them. Then, um... <clears throat> It means at least there shouldn't be any players here, unless of course they've killed them all and hidden the bodies. Which is, you know, another possibility. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I meant to do that. What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? 30 odd 6. Nice. I don't have a weapon for 30 odd 6. But, like I said, it can be sold. I really need this bloody chicken! Okay, so that went well, and I think I'm going to change my tactics, and I'm just going to shoot to kill now. Because that dude was an asshole. Basically. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. So I'm just going to shoot to kill now. Worst thing is I had some decent loot on that guy. But there we go. It is what it is. This is DayZ. It is PvP. But you do get idiots like that who just shoot to kill you. Was that a chicken? Did I just hear a chicken? Because even if I did hear a chicken... The worst thing is, I didn't hear that dude at all. Dude. Which is really annoying. He's probably completely looted my body now. Yeah, death position. 5.9k away. Quite a way away. So I've got even further to travel now back to that guy. But maybe this town will be more fruitful. Not that the other town wasn't fruitful, I have to say. Huh. Frying pan. Take that, because you can put stuff in that. But what I really want is a weapon. What I really want is a weapon. See, I don't like wearing the helmets because it covers your... Um, it skews your vision a little bit. Is that farming hoe? Well, it will be good against some things, I guess. But this is quite a big town now, so... We could end up dying here. I should have won that fight. I really should have. I don't know what he hit me with. But I should have won that fight. I shot him, what, three times I think I hit him? And he didn't go down, so... I mean, I put plenty of bullets in him with the... I know it's only 9 mil, but I put plenty of bullets in him with that. And then I got two hits. 
two hits with the um, with the Winnie, and he didn't go down. So it was rather annoying, I have to say. But yes, everybody is now a hostile in my eyes. Car battery, that would be handy if I had a vehicle. That's the hospital by the looks of it. Everybody is now a hostile. I'm not going to play nice anymore. Whoops, got stuck behind the door. Shoot to kill is open. Rope, I can take that to tie people up with. Uh, I'm sure there's a police station in this town. What I really need is a gun of some kind game. Would be nice. That is a little hatchet, but for some reason, can't pick it up. There's a gun. Does it have any ammo in it? Probably not. Oh, it does. Oh, okay. Okay. Something. It is something. At least it will help me. Yeah, let's see. This is sniper paradise. This is... This is sniper's paradise. Ooh, that is an SKS. Does it have anything in it? Oh, one. Well, got a bit of a ranged weapon. SKS uses 739. I don't think I have those, do I? No, I don't. I have 12 gauge. But... SKS, I will certainly be happy with. The fact that that's here makes me think this is the police station. The fact that that's here makes me think it's actually quite quiet in this town. Okay, the door is closed. You know full well that doesn't mean anything. Okay, stab vest. Ah, that's one of the ones you need the key, key card for. Okay. So that means that people could be coming here, so I need to be very quick and get out of here. Because if you get the key card, you can open that. Did I just pick up? I didn't even see. Oh. Magazines for the gun that I had on the previous person. That's annoying. Yeah, that locked room there, you find key cards all over the map. Ooh. You find key cards all over the map. And, um... Yeah, that's got no ammo. That has got no ammo, unfortunately. And the key cards open locked doors in various places all over the map. And obviously inside you get a crate, which has got special loot in it. You know, higher tier loot and stuff like that. Bloody hell, how many of these magazines am I finding? Jesus. Just need a gun to go with it. Handcuffs. And get kinky. Ooh. Hello. Okay, right, we have one of them now, but what I need to do is, how many can it hold? Up to 15 rounds. Okay, so that's 10, 12, so let's empty these two, and then at least we'll have two full mags. Door empty, empty you. Give me that one. Load this one up. Right, there's one mag. 
and load this one up. Right, two mags. You in there have got ten. Eleven, twelve. Right. Okay. Feeling a bit better now. Feeling a bit better. It's normally, or well, not normally, but there's, yeah, let's see, sometimes a pair of gloves, keep your hands warm. Yeah, there's no, no zombies around here at all. Which is good. Okay, right, let's get out of here before someone wants to come and do this. And annihilates me. Anything in the police car? Not this side. Whoa, don't know what happened there. Come on. Empty. What about, what about, what about, what about? Uh, more slugs. That's not what I want. Need to be quick and get out of here. In case people come. Oh, nothing. Okay. I mean, the fact that there are closed doors everywhere makes me think there isn't anybody here, but... You know how it is. It could simply be a camper in this very corner. What is that? Thermal shirt? Nope. Right, nothing around here. That's not the door, you donkey. Shovel. This is a big town, this is. Uh, disinfectant. 762. Does that take me outside again? Yes, it does. Um... 9 and that's five, four, five rounds. Okay, that's one thing that I need to remember, and there's no other way of remembering it other than just learning it. And that's all the ammo types, full of weapons. What have we got here? Range finder. Ooh. Hello. I'll take you. Nothing else? No. Okay. What's that? That's a box of nails, isn't it? Yep, take that. Always be sold. Right, okay, I think we head back now. I mean, I would like to get some ammo, but I've got a 6.1 now. March. I don't necessarily think it's a good idea going along the village like this. I need to get back into the tree line. I'm honest. A little hatchet. Petrol station there. Shoes. These buildings normally have something in them. Okay, some food, I'll take that. Nope. And, okay. Not this time, they don't. It is empty today. Empty, empty. Please. Ballistic vest. Oh, I don't want that stupid hat. Don't like that stupid hat. Also, there is sometimes weapons spawn here as well. Oh. It's over there. Yeah. Time to go. 
I can't get involved in that fight. Not yet. Not with two bullets in the SKS and one magazine. Oh, not one magazine, but you know what I mean. That's worn. Pistol. Another one. Bloody hell. Well, I'm not, I'm not complaining. It's, at least it's a gun. At least it shoots projectiles. More nails. Need to find this bloody chicken still. Speaking of chicken. Combine. I have a sticky pistol. And I've got nothing to drink. Yay! There should be a well in this town. There was probably one by the police station. Crap. Bridge? That's not good. Hello, dude. Uh, helicopter incoming. Yeah, that's not good. I don't know. He's waiting. I, I can't. Yep, time to run. get rid of these markers because I don't need them all now do I basically dead everywhere right where are we now quite far away <laughs> really quite far away Oh look, see, he's thanking me for the nails. EWP, warm cube, that's the guy who killed me. So they obviously have a base somewhere. You see that? There's a stag up there somewhere. That's the only problem with this game, is that if you don't play it constantly, you just get so... You basically get left behind in terms of finding loot and weapons, and then you just run into higher tier players who just annihilate you like that. But I think... That's not the best start. So I think I am going to leave it here. I'm going to get into this little barn. Yeah, I don't want to go into town. There's no way I'm heading into Cherno over there. Sod that. So there's a lot of people. And I have no weapons again. Why do I look like a monk? Need to find something. What is that? That is a hat. 
We'll take that. There's some wellies over there. What the hell is that? That's a medium tent in a wall. That's interesting. That's a shame you can't get that. Oh well. Rubber boots. No. Okay, anyway. Close that door. Get into one of these houses. Feel safer in a house than in a big barn like that. Don't see any movement. But I think, guys, that's where I'm going to leave it. <clears throat> so, it was a rough first episode. For Daisy. But we did actually get some stuff. And then we got an. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Take all of that. And it does have a magazine in it. So I have six bullets. Okay. Ooh, honey. Or jam, rather. Right, let's just be safe here. Close that door. Right, that's where I'm going to leave it, guys. <clears throat> Thanks very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Ring that little notification bell so you get notified when my videos go live. And as always, I'll catch you all on the next one.